the purpose of periodic tables, and I think really f the purpose of most science cafes is to show the world that science is not done by automatons and white coats. Um, it's done by human beings, and it's done by people who like to go to the bar and have a beer, and it's done by people who are comfortable talking about the work that they do. At Periodic Tables, uh, which we do here at Motorco Music Hall in Durham, which is a great venue to see a band or come to a spoken word performance or once a month come to a science cafe. We have all manner of science and scientists that we talk about. We had a round table discussion about the science of dogs. So do you ever have like your dog just stare at you for like no reason? What do you mean? What do you want? Like, I fed you, I walked you, you been to the bathroom. And they're just sitting there like this. So it ends up that there's um, an oxytocin loop that goes between people and their dogs. I'm not even kidding. Your dog wants you to look. They just want you to stare at them like this. And then if you do that for a really long time, you'll feel good. So I think that's my practical advice. Just go and just stare at your dog forever. Uh, we had Holly Menninger from North Carolina State talking about citizen science and what happens when people go out into nature and collect data or sequence their own DNA in their garage. So I'm going to be talking about public science, but before I actually define what public science is, um, I want you to do a little thought experiment and close your eyes and in your mind's eye, I would like you to conjure up an image of a public scientist. Everybody have an image? Okay. Was it one of these gentlemen? <laughs> Events like periodic tables are for anyone who's a little bit curious about science. You don't have to be a scientist, you don't need to be an intellectual, you don't need to be a faculty member. These are opportunities to come meet a scientist in a bar, learn something cool, um, and maybe take that home and apply it to your daily life. Periodic tables is a lot of fun. It's not a lecture, it's not a seminar. Um, it's come out to the bar, have a drink, uh, have something to eat and learn something new, ask some questions, have a conversation.